Hey guys, it's Knickknack here, bringing you the next episode of our Dark Souls Let's Play. Where we left off is we were about to go fight this other boss that we need to fight before we can go down to New Londo. Um, we're going to go ahead and take care of that now, and then um, we'll continue on with our progress. Uh, I can't remember, did I have enough souls to level up? Oh, I did not. Okay. So, let's go ahead and keep moving forward. Um, as you guys know, I didn't record on Labor Day, so there was a video kind of missing there, but... That's okay, because, you know, we always got to have our holidays every now and then. Uh, you know, had a little get-together with the family, so that was good. Um, you know, but I hope you guys enjoyed my videos all the way up until Sunday. Thank you so much for showing your support there. Uh, remember, um, you know, comment, uh, like, subscribe, you know, everything that you could do to help out the channel, because that's going to help the Nicknackian Empire grow. And thank you for all your support um, for everything that you guys do. So let's go ahead and dig into this. Keep on moving. Go to this next boss and get it done. And then that way we can move forward. Um, this is a little kind of update here. I mean, we are getting kind of close to the end. Um, we only have one more major boss before uh, we fight the ending boss. And that's only because we don't have, um, we don't have the DLC. Um on the Xbox so we can't really go do the DLC or definitely I would want to do the DLC with you guys as well just to give kind of a complete playthrough of this game but it's okay hopefully they'll release that at some point if they do release it then I'll just make kind of a, a little add-on you know it's not like it's new but you know it'd be good just to feel like we're completely completing the series so you know, kind of a little housekeeping thing there, but anyway, let's go ahead and keep moving. Um, I do continue to keep my my upload schedule seven days a week, so if you guys are excited about that, like I am, I'm definitely excited to keep it up, uh, keep up my one day a week, one episode a week type of thing, or one episode a day, not one episode a week. Um, you know, of everything, and then um, after this, we have some more let's plays. The next thing I'm going to do is kind of radically different from what I'm playing right now. So I hope you guys are into that. I like switching it up because, you know, you gotta have a diverse, gotta have some type of diverseness, I guess if that's a word, um, in your your gameplay, or everything starts to get kind of stale. So, like if I only play Dark Souls, then it would get kind of stale. I mean, I love Dark Souls, but you can't only play one game. So, anyway, enough of me rambling about whatever. Let's focus on the game here. We're just kind of making our way through the woods, which. It's over the river and through the woods to the next boss we go. <laughs> and this is like one of the most heartbreaking bosses in the game. Like, I don't really like fighting this boss because I just, I feel for him, man. The feels are real in this one. I'm actually going to take both these out for now. Alright, ready? Let's do it. All right, here we go. It looks like a little normal area, right? Well, actually, you can kind of tell that it's a uh, it's a boss fight. And that's the sword of Artorius. The guy's like, "Yo, this sword's kind of cool. I'm gonna take it." And he's like, "Uh, no, you ain't." That's my master sword. Yeah. Ooh, that was a nice flip. Ow. 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 Can I please get, uh, do something crazy and like, oh. Come on, Sif. Let's, let's be real here for a second. I just need you to back off for me for a second. So I can, uh... Wow, I'm really feeling like this so far. I think I'm rusty. <laughs> what do you guys think? There we go.
Billy Seth. Keep moving a lot, Seth. I don't know how I feel about that. What you need to do with Sith is get in his back legs like this. Because there's not too much Sith can do on his back legs. Mm. Really, Sith? Last time I fought Sith, I don't think he moved around this much. Maybe because I killed him too quickly, because as you guys know, I kind of ran through last time I played this game. It doesn't look like this is going to be too crazy, though. But the reason why I meant, um, I meant to tell you guys why I thought this was so sad. The reason why I think it's so sad is because if you know anything about the lore of Sith, he's just trying to protect his master's grave. That's really all he's trying to do. And you just come in and like, no, you're not going to protect anybody's grave. You know what I mean? He's kind of, you're kind of a douche in this one. Grab this, the hornet ring, I'll take that. Alrighty then. That is a sift down. I didn't think he would take too long. I am kind of over leveled for this part. I didn't mean to wait this long to come back here and do this, but... Kinda totally forgot about Sith. Maybe it's because I really don't like to kill Sith. <gasps> no, I died. Wow, I was looking over and totally just walked off the bridge. Interesting, interesting. Well, I'm not gonna leave all those souls up there. So, we gotta run back real quick. And grab those souls. And then we'll come back and get started down in New Orlando. New Lon New Orlando. New Londo. I don't know why I always say or for some reason. We gotta go down to New Londo and then we can continue on our progress that way. What, the one thing that the reason why you have to fight Sift is because you have to get the, the ring of Artorius, I'm pretty sure it is. And that allows you to walk in like the dark part. Like the darkness. So we're gonna lose our flips whenever we go down there, which kind of sucks. But I'm not taking off the ring of favor for sure. But normal rolls aren't that bad. I kind of have to get used to the timing again, though, because timing is a little bit off com compared to the flips. The flips kind of give you a little bit more timing. Anyway, we're just making our way back up here real quick. Want to make sure we get our souls back. Oh, this ladder. I forgot about this ladder. And that waterfall is crazy too. It's pretty loud. All right. Yeah, but I don't want to spoil our next Let's Play right now. Um, I think it's going to be pretty cool once it starts. Um, I'm just doing some preparations for it. I've been doing some preparation for it for the last couple weeks or so, just trying to make sure everything was right on it. Doing some little testing on it just to see if it would come through okay for you guys. Um, you know, and things like that. So once we're done with this one, we're all set to move on to the next one. And then... I'm not going to do Dark Souls right away, like Dark Souls 2 right away after we beat this one. Um, just to get, like I said, just to give some variety. I'm not sure if that was clear when I was saying it before, so I wanted to make sure I was saying it again here. And then um, we'll kind of, we'll stagger it out. I mean, my, my main goal here is just to stagger it out, kind of. So Dark Souls 1, do that, beat it. We're already on our way to doing that, and then... Um, play one or two games in between then Dark Souls 2 play one or two games in between then Dark Souls 3 and um, you know if we get some more support and we get some more you know uh, things that allow me to do this longer 
um, then eventually we will move up to two videos a day, or two or three videos a day, if I can. It's just right now, trying to do two or three videos a day while I'm working and going to school is a little rough. Um, so, that's the reason why we get one a day. And one a day, I mean, it allows you to allows me to keep up with the series and make sure I'm making good progress for you. Hopefully, you guys ain't getting bored of it. And I'm always wanting to take suggestions for games like uh, for games that you guys want to see me play too. So definitely, uh, definitely, you know, hit up that comment section so I can play some games that maybe you guys want to see me play. It wouldn't be next series though. Next Let's Play I already got kind of planned out. So the series after that, if you guys show some support and uh, you know tell me what you guys want to see me play, then I'll play it. The only thing I request is that uh, whenever you, if you do comment down below with the game that you want to see me play is that um, you make it, I don't know, something that has some type of story so we can actually play through it and look and you know make progress through it. Like it's kinda hard to play through Minecraft and things like that because um, there's no really story element. You know what I mean? I know I can do some creative every time that we jump on it but there would be really no, no never ending. It would be kinda never ending at that point so. Something that's a little bit story driven would be cool. But I am willing to play anything, you know, that you guys want as well, so don't feel limited. Alright. Anyway, we're making our way back here to our bonfire we got an, we definitely have enough souls to um to light this bonfire so let's go ahead and do that and then we'll go down to new londo little cave here. Level up real quick. Level up. Alright, so let's level up dexterity. Strength. Uh, let's strength for now. Like I said, we're just doing a 40-40 build, so nothing too crazy. And let's go to... I guess we're going back to Firelink. There are some things that we need to go back and get to before we go fight uh, the final boss in this. So after we do New Orlando, oh, I said it again, New Orlando, New Londo. After we beat New Londo, then we'll go down to we'll we'll do like a kind of a last type of you know we're gonna do a couple things type of episode, uh, maybe one or two episodes actually, just to get everything done. Um, and then uh, we'll go and face the last boss once we get this, once we uh, do everything that we need to do. So far, this has kind of been an update episode. All I've been talking about is updates. Updates. Well, I like to talk about it because it keeps us on track for sure. We've been doing a pretty decent job of keeping on track with this series, so. I can be a little bit of a spaz sometimes and forget about certain things, so. It's good to keep my mind going on this. Alright, we're back in New Londo, where we're supposed to be. I'm gonna take that stock thing out. Thank you, thank you. I need to pop a transient. 
curse. Because if not, I won't be able to hit none of the baddies here. I didn't mean to hit you, man. Sorry. You're so scary here. Spooky scary. Spooky scary skeletons. Not really skeletons, but spooky scary ghost. Isn't there a way over there? I'm pretty sure there's a way. Maybe I have to I think I have to get rid of the Wawa first. The Wawa. Is there wait a minute? Because I know I dropped down that. I may not have an option. No, I don't think I have an option because he just pushed me up. Oh, well, no, there we go. Alright, cool. Yeah, because I kicked down this ladder in the last episode, if you guys remember. And that made it easier to get over here. Because we do have to go this way. Anyway, <laughs> we do have to go this way to get the, um... Well, get to the boss, and then also release the Wawa, the Wata... I know there's a lot of ghosts that kind of pop up down here. Yeah. Is this the right way? I'm so lost. Take that. And you guys are messing me up. Oh my goodness. They were like, you are in the wrong neighborhood. <laughs> this is for ghost only. Really, I didn't. Okay. Well, let's report back to Firelink. <laughs> I totally, totally thought that we, uh, we did what we were supposed to do there and rested at the fire link one but oh well all right let's rest all right let's continue on our journey now that we rest at the actual right bonfire maybe we can Make some progress. We have that shortcut too, so it didn't take us very long. I mean, the only thing that really took us long was the stupid elevator here. But. I mean, I didn't have too many issues with this boss either that's coming up. Last time, but... Like I said, once again, last time I was using an Ultra Greatsword, which if any of y'all know anything about this game, an Ultra Greatsword is kind of, it's kind of a, kind of a good weapon. I mean, it's slow, but it does really kind of quickly get rid of things. So, you just had to hit him a couple times. You just got to hit him up. So you guys aren't going to stop us from releasing the water this time. Sorry, guys. Like, we're cool and everything, but... I can't let you guys stop me from releasing the water. Alright, I'm going to pop this just in case I get into some trouble. Ow. That's not cool of you guys. Wow, I'm getting super laggy. 
Super lag. Alright. Seemed to even itself out. I don't think that's the right way now I think about it. Let's go in here. Um, my main goal right now is to release the water. So that's what I'm trying to get to. Oh, somebody didn't. Somebody's really upset. Here we go. Hey guys, can you kind of back off, please? Please and thank you. Thank you and please. Does not move. And that is locked. Oh, I have to go get the key. Here. Oh, okay. This looks out on the, where the gates are. Ooh, got the composite bow. That's cool. Okay, so. We have to go get the key from a place over here. And then we can... Am I supposed to go up or over? Well, I'm going up because there is way too many ghosties. And we know what happens when I try to fight too many ghosties. They all like to gang up. Hey, ghosty guys. What's up? I mean, we're cool and all, but you guys don't need to be... You guys don't need to be such, uh, such gangy up guys. I don't like that. I don't like ghost gang. I don't like ghost gang. Stay away from me, ghost gang. Alright, so we need to go this way to get the key, if I'm not mistaken. Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? There's so many of you. Oh my goodness. Why is there so many of you? Come on, come on. You can get out. Oh. Okay, so the fireball helped clear out some of them. Well, there we go. Between my fireball jutsu and my trusty... My trusty, uh... War pick. We managed to clear them all out. The majority of them. Yo, yo, bro. Are we cool? Okay. That I know exactly. You seek the this. Yes, I get it. The Thank you. The four use this key. Oh, and do not forget the dark wraiths. Riza Patia visis Olo. If you can find him and learn from him. So this is both. This is basically meant to tell you that you need the you need the ring to be able to get down there and actually fight the four kings. The ring that we just got from Sith. So, 
We got that. We ain't worried about that. We good. We good. Let's go release. Let's go release the Kraken. Release the Kraken. And then we should be good to go. It's not really a Kraken. It's just some water, but it'd be much cooler if there was. Here we go. Cutscene. There we go. All the water. All the water is gone now. Is the boss right here? I can't remember. I don't think it is. I don't think the boss is right here. I think I have to go down. And the boss is on the very ground level. I do remember there are some dark ice though. And the dark rays don't mess around. There's the dark ray. I heard him. I know you guys heard him too. <laughs> yeah, dark rays can do some damage if you let them. And if you're fast enough, you don't have to worry about it. This is really gruesome. Those are all like bodies. I was like, ugh. When I first saw this, I was like, something about like musty water bodies that just don't really, uh, don't really, uh, really, uh, make you feel too good. The Dark Souls all is all about kind of gruesome scenes like that. In a way. Hey guy, what's up? What's up? Nope. Oh, you were trying to block me. He's like, I'm gonna block you. I'm gonna block you. I was like, eh -eh. no, not with my war pick. You will not. All right, I need to see where I'm going. Uh, let's run because I hear dark is behind me. There we go. I'll take that chunk. That boy was really trying to... He was really trying to hurt me. I don't know how I feel about that. Alright, see the thing about New Londo though is that there is no bonfire. You know, I always like to end off at a bonfire. Um, but the boss is right here. So I think where we're going to leave off... I think we're going to leave off in the boss room. And then... We're going to pick up right here next episode. Okay? I know I only have four Estus flags, but I might as well give it a good try before we go. But anyway, I'm going to leave it off right here. We're going to go ahead and try the boss next episode. See if we can get through it, and then we'll come back. Um, but definitely thank you guys so much for watching the episode today. Remember to like, comment, subscribe down below. And remember, whatever you do, it's all good.